It's an election year, but it's also 2020, the year of the pandemic. And while many have already cast their ballots through the mail to avoid crowded polling stations, according to an NPR PBS NewsHour Marist poll, more people are voting in person than expected. But in the days of COVID, is it safe to do so? Bioethicist and former health advisor for the Obama administration, Zeke Emanuel, says there is some risk, of course, but he tells The Atlantic it's about as dangerous as going to the grocery store. With the head of infectious diseases and vaccinology at UC Berkeley, Lee Riley, telling Huff Post, quote, for the voters themselves, as long as they wear a mask and maintain social distancing of six feet and sanitize their hands after they cast their vote, the risk is minimal. Adding, it's the poll workers who are really the high-risk individuals. That's not to say there isn't any risk at all. Those with underlying health conditions and compromised immune systems should probably steer clear and stick to mail-in ballots. But anyone who is going to vote in person should make a plan to go when the polls are the least busy, wear your mask, and definitely do not show up at the voting station if you're feeling ill.